Welcome back. We have our mask on. It is time for Florida to re-mask up. I got mine on. The new law now is to wear the mask in the house. It's not to keep the coronavirus from spreading and slowing down, but it is to slow us down from eating. And so that's why we have been talking this morning about glutton. What a great opportunity to be locked in the house, all this food, and we don't hear about the sin of gluttony. I love you, and I don't want you to overeat. I want you to follow that discipline. Uh, Proverbs 3 talks about if you are a person given to a appetite, control your appetite. Now, this appetite immediately context was food, but it extends to every area of our life where God has given us liberty for us not to overindulge, for us not to uh, be inundated and uncontrollable when it comes to our appetite. If we can get a God-given um, gift of food uh, under control, it would help us in the other areas of getting it under control. Food is a tough one, but if we get that under control, we can control some of the other. This is the second in a series uh, of the infection of a virus, and the virus of gluttony is one of the seven deadly sins. I hope that you will take it in love, make the adjustment uh, during this pandemic time, and learn to discipline your life. Let us trust God to meet and provide for us, not we provide for ourselves. If we're stressed out, don't use food, use God. God bless you and keep you as our prayer.